para hindi tayo mawala. Ayan, so yung last part natin dito is yung ano, yung test. But the test is not the test itself where there would be a simulation. Uh, what I would require you to have is the presentation of your prototypes. You explain your prototype next week. Okay, so that would be on Tuesday as well. Yeah, so I would be giving 15 minutes each group to present their prototypes, and first they they are going to. Anyways, ilalagay ko lahat yung instructions sa inyong canvas. They're going to explain. You are going to explain your challenge, and then again, ipapapipi present niyo yung empathy map niyo, and then of course ipapapipi present niyo yung point of view, and then yung ideation niyo, yung process, ay yung process, yung method, and then of course yung prototype type ninyo. Okay? So, that would be your final performance task. Yung presentation and then yung proto pro prototype. Okay? But, let me continue with my discussion doon sa uh, prototype na uh, tinatawag na natin kanina, no? Uh, we were actually discussing, ayan, nagko-convert guys yung ano, yung lecture kanina. So I would be the, uh, posting this later para sa mga hindi naka-attend ngayon. Kasi marami atang brown out din ngayon, kaya may mga hindi naka-attend. So, ayan. Doon na lang nila tingnan yung, ano, yung instructions. Anyways, anyhow, again, as I was saying a while ago, great ideas actually started. Great ideas that we are having right now, especially with the application, started with prototyping. And uh, uh, your ideas might be might not be just for local people, but might be it could also uh, help in the international community. Now, in here, not only uh, we have your high five prototypes enable you to show, ayan, to show ha, your colleagues and stakeholders from other departments and exactly how the final uh, product should look like. So, uh, I've seen in CNN, meron, meron ano, a portion sa CNN na they are actually investing. There are, uh, uh, they invite yung mga ano, they invite yung mga a uh, big businessman here in the Philippines and then uh, there are they also started with this na yung prototype um they presented this and uh, this um this uh, their prototypes to those uh, no, to those big businesses and then the big businessman uh, tries to also negotiate with how much they would be investing on the uh, this one kasi nga ang mga IT specialist guys yung mga gumagawa ng applications alam niyo ba na ang lalaki ng bayad nila so ayan uh, Uh, dito nag-start lahat. Kaya, syempre, ang laki ng pera sa si internet, ang laki ng pera sa sa YouTube, whatever it is, yung mga, ano, anong connection nun? Actually, doon nila ina-advertise sa mga applications na nagagawa. Which, again, those applications could also help the, the little problems that the people are actually experiencing. Like, si, for example, exercise, ganyan, which ha happens or with, which matters a lot. And, uh, Ayan, uh, little did we know, no? Parang uh, hindi natin nararamdaman. But again, this kind of things could actually also try to lighten the quality of, uh, I mean, try to enhance the quality of life. Whatever society we belong to, uh, it actually try to, uh, uh, it tries to enhance our quality of life by having this kind of uh, prototypes, these machineries, and so on. How to create a prototype? Best practices. Now we know exactly what prototyping is. Why is it so valuable, and what kinds of prototype we might use throughout the design process? There's only one thing left to do: create your own. Here are some. Uh, pointers that will help you along the way. First is that you are to choose the right kind of prototype. But as I've mentioned a while ago, I don't ask you to to be so high uh, to to have the high fidelity prototype, the high detailed prototype. Because again, I'm saying na hindi naman tayo expert dito. Okay, so I can just ask you your paper. But if you could elevate that to a more aesthetically pleasing uh, uh, product, then go for it, guys. <laughs> Ayan, why not? Um, I, I would uh, appreciate it much, okay? Set concrete goals. Have a clear idea of what you want your prototype to achieve. In other words, what do you want to find out when you test your prototype? Remember to focus on users' needs. Ano yung pangangailangan ng, ng ano natin, ng, uh, uh, ng ano natin, ng... 
uh, beneficiaries natin. So some of you have chosen actually uh, yung prototype nila is ano, yung prototype nila is um Uh, yung pro uh, I mean yung challenge nila is yung mga mga estudyante how are you going to help these students in a way na siguro magagawa tayo ng applications that would help them manage their time and so on so ano yung ano yung gusto natin no yan uh, set concrete goals have a clear ayan sorry uh, use the right tools if you're new to uh, new to digital prototyping spend more time playing around with a few of the most imp- uh, most popular in the three tools. So, uh, siguro ito, I'm not asking, I'm not gonna ask you na kasi I know that you have some other uh, requirements to finish and uh, uh, siguro mag-base na lang tayo. Pero kung kaya naman ng time natin, why not go for it? I'm not, I'm not, um, I'm not setting so much expectation when it comes to the prototype. Basta ang gusto ko makita ko kung paano siya, yung logic nito, and also how does it go. Now, again, yung criteria naman natin is nandoon. Take action. Uh, design thinking is all about generating ideas and testing item. Uh, yung testing natin, again, explaining the ideas, how it would help our beneficiaries. Okay? So, that's all, guys. It's very short, no? This is the instruction. Read and understand and satisfy what is required for 50 points have a better idea of the constraints inherent to the product and the problems that are present and have a clearer view of how uh, real users would behave think and feel when interacting with the product with the end product choose the kind of prototype to be used but if you are just going to, to use the low fidelity uh, that would be uh, still much appreciated prioritize breadth over depth as we look uh, for a diverse range of ideas to prototype and test i uh, and test the real with real people Okay, so again, this activity is 50 points, which would be uh, included in your performance task. Okay, now, again, next week, you're going to present this prototype. So, uh, please prepare a PowerPoint presentation ayan, that could uh, present all your ideas from the challenges that you have chosen from the empathy i'm i'm pretty sure that you still have the file ayan and then and up to the prototype itself and then of course it's explain how would your prototype work how would the prototype that you have made uh would be able to kind of uh, solve or ease the challenges that your users are experiencing so that's all guys uh I, I think I would like to end my uh, discussion about prototype there. But if you have some questions, again, you can uh, uh, feel free to ask it now. Ayan. Uh, again, I was able to um, I was able to receive uh, the uh, group three uh, uh, group three grill. <laughs> group three's uh, ideation. So I'm still waiting for the other groups. Okay, I was able to check also the other groups already. So if um, you think you were not able to do, to submit it yet, please submit it now. And yung sa point of view, may mga hindi pa nakapag-submit, so paki-submit na lang. Okay, so again, next week would be the presentation. So make sure na yung mga kaklase natin, yung mga kagroup natin is present next week. Kasi next week yung ano natin, yung presentation natin. Okay, so... Questions for?